so I uh, was on my way out to a pretty popular spot down here in Wilmington and I'm seeing a lot of bait birds are working all over here beside me so I said well what do you got to lose let's stop and see what's underneath it if anything a lot of times as fishermen we get caught up in following other boats but the key is follow the birds and, and there's not always fish under the birds but most of the time there's a reason they're there one it's because of bait two whenever you have bait there's an opportunity to have that predation as well so we're gonna stop and see if there's anything under this there's a lot of bait on the the bottom right now oh man look at the look at the screen like that is that's good fish whatever that is and the birds are gone from this area just got hit okay all right on my way up first fish of the day i've got a little blue fish all right so we know that there are predators here and all right now look at this bait ball right here that's insane i'm just in the middle of like a couple miles off the beach right now and because i just caught a blue fish i'm going to speed up my retrieve whenever you're catching blues if you're trying to catch the pelagics you're not reeling fast enough and you can see all the birds working kind of off in the distance where all those boaters are i'm near them but i'm not really near them like if i could hook a spanish right now i'd have these fish to myself it's really uh, easy to get impatient when fishing for these faster retrieve fish you got to let your bait sink you got to try to work all of the water column okay you've cast it 100 yards out you retrieved you didn't get a hit okay let's try to do some vertical jigging let's let's try to let it sink you know half the time five seconds instead of ten see if they're in mid water column versus coming straight off the bottom you have to try different things to catch these fish We got a good one on. It was good anyway. Kind of let that one just dead fall. It's fighting really strange. Might actually be uh, tail hooked or something. I really don't know yet. I think I'm tail hooked. Not sure. Because it has not made a run yet. Trying to be cautious, just ah, dang it. That was a good one, whatever it was. About to find out what's down here. They are thick, whatever they is. There it is. Feels I can't bluefish. Gray trout, okay. So the gray trout are thick right here. I would not have expected that. Let's uh, let's not make any assumptions. Let's get him back and uh, drop again and see. My screen is lit up, so let's see if it's just schools of these gray trout. I guess a school of them just went under me because oh, on again. This feels a little better. Unless he's like tail hooked or something yep all right so about the 12 inch gray trout are really thick in this area i'm looking for more pelagic fish we're on we're on with something what we got good fish what we got? What we got? I haven't seen it yet. Bluefish. Decent bluefish. Get him back. That'd be a good eater. There we go good fish all right spanish let's see if we can boat flip him oh that ain't how you do it all right 
first one of the year. He's a little dude, about 12, 13 inches. A little bit bigger than that. Let's see if I can get him free. Just at 13 to the fork. So at uh, he's just under 13. So they got to be 12 to the fork and keep 15 a day. So we're gonna throw him in the box and hook some friends up with some Spanish. Bleed him out. They always taste better bled out. Gosh, man, bunch of fish down there in the bottom of the water column. I'd show you, but I don't. Oh, there we go. I was just saying that there was some fish down here at the bottom of the water column. This feels good. What we got? It's probably a blue. Yep. Okay. Foul hook blue at that. All right, buddy. Get you back. I'll get you back. Go. All right, good fish. Feels solid. Okay. Feeling good. Feeling good. Feeling good. Haven't seen it yet. fish all right cool flipped him off trying to find that speed just above where the blue fish are gonna kind of leave my stuff alone all right we're on I hit close to the bottom oh it came off oh he cut me he cut me he cut me high too oh no oh that's painful. Okay. I don't have any more of those jigs. Ugh, no bueno. No bueno, mi amigo. Okay. All right. Well, we're going to be trying something different now. I guess. There we go. My tree. I think that's a bluefish. Feeling very bluey. Hopefully I'm wrong, but we'll see. It might not be a bluefish. Because it's darting and slashing and swiping so much. Oh yeah, it's blues. They're like attacking. That's the way to do it. Go ahead and flip them off at the boat. up on me okay all right so i got to speed up a little bit more from that yeah the blues were like attacking the blue that was on the line trying to get him get over get whatever the bait was that he had speed up a little bit definitely not working as good as that uh that pink was Frankenstein a bait up. Ah, that was a Spanish. He's still messing with it. There he is. There he is. That's got to be a Spanish. Because I, ha I had a pretty quick retrieve on that. Maybe not. It might be a blue as well, yeah. Alright. Yep, a little blue. Man. They're, they're letting themselves off the hook today, which works. That works just fine. All right. I got a real faster than that. Also, I'm like, I'm trying to let it sink. Give it time to get down. It's tough when there's that many bluefish around. 
needed to get down there. Alright, we're just gonna count. I'm gonna give it 10 seconds. Reeling a lot quicker here. Oh, there we go. I like that. All right, come on. Tighten up the drag a little bit. Be a Spanish. It's acting like a Spanish. It's not giving me those bluefish bulldogs. We're going to see here shortly. Coming in. Oh, yeah. Spanish, and there's a whole school of them underneath them. Come on, baby. Come on. Boat flip. Boom. That's a good one, too. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, sir. All right. That's a little better class there. Now we're talking that 16-inch class. Oh, wow. I want to show you guys what he's eating. Look at that glass minnow. Good fish coming in the boat. I love it, man. Don't mind Griffin, he's uh he's getting him a little nap. And that's uh there's your bait right there, bait of choice. That's what they're eating. Really interesting. Alright, fish are turning on. It's been good. Good the last 10 minutes or so. Alright, we're on. Or are we hung? This feels like a fish. What is, what is this? I've got a, ta I tail hooked one. I foul hooked one in the tail, bluefish. Okay. Old boy was uh, trying to have uh, lunch with his family. And he done got gut hooked. Oh, that's not even a bluefish. It is a bluefish. Okay. One way to do it, catching them upside down. Blues are thick today. Trying to weed through them and get Spanish though. All right, we're on. Can't tell what it is yet. Feeling a lot of pulses. That's typically not good. Or not really pulses in this situation. It feels like a bluefish. I can't tell yet. Yep. Nice bluefish too. There we go. That's what I like to see. There we go. There we go. Uh, is that a blue? Yep. Come on, flip off, baby. Okay. Let me do this the old fashioned way. There we go. There we go. That should be a Spanish. No, maybe not. Maybe not. Man, that was on the surface and I was retrieving pretty quick. I'm not sure. Just caught so many bluefish. Okay, he's starting to come to me a little easier. He might be a nice size Spanish. No, can't tell yet. Oh yeah, good Spanish. All right, I gotta get this one in. Man, okay. That is a good Spanish. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh, no, no, no. All right, that was, the, that was the fish of the day right there. God. Well, we've got something that's working, which is half the battle. Yeah, we're on. We're on. Oh, I can't tell what it is yet. Making a lot of ground, so I'm thinking it could be a Spanish. Nope. Oh, he cut me. Oh my gosh, I'm losing so many jigs today. Oh man, I shouldn't have been checking it better though. That's my own fault. Ah, 
I just got a hit. There we go. We're on. We're on. I'll be a blue fish as hard as this fight. I was reeling pretty quickly though. Yeah, blue fish. Good one. Come on, dog. There we go. I can't tell yet. A little early. I think it might be a Spanish the way it's uh it's kind of coming directly at me. I don't know actually. I don't know actually. I haven't seen it yet. It's acting very bluish now. Blue fish. Quality bluefish though for this time of year. There we go. Hit it right at the boat. That was really close to the boat. Be a Spanish. Yeah, there we go. Okay, I, I, I did that. Accidentally bumped the drag too much. I keep losing fish at the boat, so I'm trying to give them a little more. I don't have my net because I'm an idiot. That's a good fish. All right, there we go. I love it, man. <laughs> That's a quality one there. Man, solid fish right there. It's so beautiful. Get them bled out and get them in the, in the box. front of me it's like a 20 footer and it just turned around and came back out the inlet i guess because it got a little sketchy all right i'm pretty much on the back of a wave now we're just gonna cruise in see this, this section of mass of water we're just staying right on the back side of that in between the this wave and the wave behind me that's how you can safely come in an inlet that's shallow or doesn't have a jetty See the wave kind of coming behind me? I'm in between the two waves. So we're safe as long as I can stay right here. Cool, this is going great. Yep. Oh yeah, we're good, we're golden now. Seven foot of water. wave is still right beside me we're staying right in front of it and we're almost through the rough stuff and I've stayed right there on the back side of this wave the entire time now I'm crossing it I'm gonna go ahead and go over it yeah we're good 